What's the deal, y'all, on YouTube? Today, I am going to be talking about the um, Germany experience, living in Germany experience part two. Uh, on the other end, um, I got my BMW, my first car when I was 21. It was a stick shift, so, you know, I was going everywhere, riding. Um, pastries are dope, man. Um, I know on occasion, I had, um, for my birthday, my neighbor in Zephyrin, she gave me some candy for my birthday. And I didn't know that it um, had alcohol in it. <laughs> it tasted funny. I didn't know. I couldn't read the words. And my mom told me, that, yeah, you know, the candy um, has alcohol in it. You know? I know we used to go to the Ara and get the uh, Magnum Magnum ice cream uh, bars that they got now in the um, in the states. We used to get the uh, purple. We used to get the strawberry drink. Oh man, that drink was so freaking good, man. Oh man, that drink was so good, man. You know, get on the autobahn and just cruise, just drive everywhere. <clears throat> I know um, I had caught the train from. Um, I can't think of the name of the town. Uh, I called it to Cologne, Germany, from Prune, where my ex-girlfriend, first love, lived. went to one of her friend's house and uh, went to go see the cathedral and everything. Man, it was nice, man. Church took a bunch of pictures. It was it was, it was was pretty good. Then, you know, I got a chance to go to uh, Paris. I got to see the Eiffel Tower at night. It has 20,000 lights man it was it was sweet man that light up at night night time um germany you know they got some very good wine and you know they got schnitzel which is you know fried pork chop lemon schnitzel fried pork chop you know palm fritz fries um cola and you know they had a mcdonald's in bitburg mcdonald's was different so they it's they cooked the food with lard then, you know, you had the Burger King in Trier. I seen that. That was kind of cool. Um, or is that very, very aggressive people? Very aggressive. I know one time um, I had um, broke down coming from Coyotes on the side of the road. I had my BMW and I had a flat tire. I had my high beams on. The German lady stops. She seen it. So another GI Air Force guy. He helped me change the tire. I couldn't get that lug nut off to save my life, man. That thing was so hard. He kicked it with his boot, got it off, man. And then um, I drove slow all the way um, to get back home. And then I got stopped by the post. I, they had stopped me, asked me what's going on. I said I had just changed my tire, so I was going slow, slower. So, I mean, man, I had, man, I had some experiences. Met a lot of great people, man. You know, some friends. Just used to hang, used to hang out every night of the week. I was going to college, University of Maryland College over there. Um, I worked for the uh, AFES, Army Air Force Exchange Services. I was working at Burger King. That I worked, uh, worked at a furniture store, which wasn't cool. I had a bad experience with that, but you know, that's another story for another time. But um, hold on, man. I had this club, was had this pool called Castell. Bitburg, man, that joint was nice, man. You know, they had a they had a heated pool, they had a locker room, then you could shower yourself. You had locker you had lockers, you could lock your stuff up. Um, you know, it was pretty great. Then you know, McDonald's went too far, then you had the base, then you had downtown Bitburg, then you go get yourself some Italian ice, then you go get you get you some um what was the food? Get you a um a gyro, get you a gyro, chicken or lamb. You had the Turkish people uh, running it. Uh, it was pretty good, man. It was pretty good with the pita bread, man, and the, and the palm fritz, the fries. Oh, nothing to die for, man. It was delicious. <laughs> it was so delicious, man. The last time I went to Germany was uh, 19 years ago. I would love to go back to visit. I know a lot has changed since then. And if you ever get a chance, um, it's a beautiful country. It's very Americanized and there's a lot to do. And um, 
you can get a pass to travel Europe the whole, for the whole summer. They had the Bonhoeff pass. I know it was, I know it was very inexpensive when I was living there, but um, if you ever get a chance, uh, check it out, man. You'll have time in your life, man. It really is a good time, fun times, man. I I had, I had a blast. I had a ball, man. I I wouldn't, I wouldn't trade that experience in for anything, man. On traveling anywhere else, man. It was it was great, man. I, I wouldn't mind doing it again. I love traveling and um I'm be talking about traveling a little more and some other topics. Just let me know what you want to talk about. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe and hit that notification bell. And uh if you want to hear more stories about Germany, uh just let me know. And Peace. I'm out. Catch you on the next video. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. Peace.